Antonia and her husband were estranged? Yes. She moved here after she separated from her husband two months ago. But Antonia still wore a wedding ring? She wore the wedding ring and a necklace. She always wore a religious necklace. That's about all of her jewelry. We didn't find any jewelry upstairs. You haven't pocketed any evidence, have you? That's outrageous. Are you accusing me of theft? We're hunting a killer, madam. I would have expected a little more cooperation. So, the fruit market was the last stop off Antonia made. Let's go. Looking for police. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. And where exactly are we going? What's your read on Maldonado? I still like him for it. Seriously, that line about the guy at the fruit market making eyes at his woman? We'll get to the market, and the guy behind the counter will tell us he saw Angel drag his old lady off into the night. This case will be shut like all the others. was left just up there, overlooking the market. Could have come here from the start and saved ourselves a day's legwork. I just don't know how to dance. LAPD, spot. Detective Phelps and Galloway. Clem Feeney, what can I do for you? Did you happen to see a young woman last night, 21 years old, Hispanic? Sure, she came by last night. Why do you ask? The young lady arrived around midnight? Yeah, something like that. Used the phone for a cab and then left. She looked like she was having a good night to you? Eh, hard to tell. Might have just been the booze that was making her seem maudlin. Where did she go from here? She wanted a cab, but I couldn't get her one. I was about to offer to drive her, but a car pulled up and she got into that. Can you describe the car? Brown Ford Coupe, I think. She seemed to know the guy. Do you mind if we look around? Why would you want to do that? Because we say so. I guess you can. Don't you have to get a court order or something? I have rights. Clem? Shh. No wonder he stays open late at night. People have to get their vitamins. Check through this stuff before we get back out there. Why cut someone who was already dead? It's a typical power thing. Once the stiff is dead, the creep usually feels they can do whatever they like. Must have seen it during the war. Are you working Friday night? We should go out afterwards. So what are we hiding in here? This thing needs a combination.
This fruit skull punk gets about 10 seconds to explain before I pull his fucking arms off. Clem! God damn it, get after him, Cole. I'll try to shoot out his tires. Wish me luck. Hit it. Clean this asshole off the road. We should have grabbed him when we had the chance, Phelps. When we had the chance, we didn't know he was our guy. Strange that he'd leave a trail of blood right back to his own market. Maybe he wanted to be caught. A lot of them do. You gotta get me closer! It's almost too perfect, isn't it? There's no such thing as too perfect. Hit him, Cole! Spin him out! Keep it steady and I'll try to bust his tires! Sick man, Clem. You need help. Outstanding job on this case, gentlemen. The poor woman can now rest in peace. I'll pay the fiend a personal visit myself and remind him that crime in this city does not go unpunished. When they finish with him at the receiving hospital, we'll have him up before the grand jury. I have a meeting this afternoon with the mayor, lads. I'll be sure to mention your names. Now, on your way.